The Republic of Uzbekistan is a landlocked country located in Central Asia. It is bordered by Kazakhstan to the north, Tajikistan to the southeast, Kyrgyzstan to the northeast, Afghanistan to the south, and Turkmenistan to the southwest. Uzbekistan is a unitary presidential republic. Its capital and largest city is Tashkent. Like most of its Central Asian neighbors, Uzbekistan was part of the USSR until attaining its independence in 1991. Uzbekistan is home to 31.5 million people. Ethnic Uzbeks comprise over 80% of its citizenry, but the country has significant small populations of Russians, Tajiks, and Kazakhs as well. A majority of Uzbeks are non-denominational Muslims. Most people here speak the Uzbek language, but Russian is commonly spoken and written here as well. The Uzbek economy relies heavily on agriculture, especially the raising of cotton. But the country also produces uranium and gold, and it has excellent reserves of natural gas, too. Uzbekistan is well known for the incredible examples of classic Islamic architecture found in its ancient towns along the route of the Silk Road that long ago linked China and India to the West. Strongly influenced by the culture of Persia, several of these structures are completely covered with colorful, richly glazed tiles and mosaics. The finest examples of this architectural style are located in ancient Samarkand, the complex of buildings seen here surround the public square in the heart of the city. Each of the three main buildings are madrasas, Islamic religious schools. The oldest of them, on the right, dates back to the 1400s. Roughly 80% of Uzbekistan consists of the dry desert land that predominates in the sparsely populated northern and western parts of the country. This is the area of Uzbekistan where the Aral Sea is located. The satellite photos seen here, taken in 1989 and in 2014, clearly show how much the Aral Sea has been depleted during that 25-year period, as water was diverted from the rivers that used to flow into it. These rivers are the Amu and the Sir, which have their headwaters in the mountains of Tajikistan and Kyrgyzstan. Most of these rivers' water is now used for raising cotton. However, due to Uzbekistan's substandard irrigation practices, coupled with soil that's been degraded by the overuse of agricultural chemicals, less than 10% of the country's land can now be effectively cultivated for farming. In the far northeastern part of Uzbekistan, the foothills of the Tian Shan Mountains rise up from the flat, low-lying plains. The road seen here crosses over the mountains and provides a route into neighboring Kyrgyzstan. The most fertile land in Uzbekistan is found in the Fergana Valley, which is located in this eastern region of the country. The Republic of Uzbekistan has a continental climate, with extremely hot summers and generally cool winters, with occasional snow falling in the city of Tashkent. But for the most part, it is an arid country with precipitation that averages between 4 to 8 inches each year.